Yo, what's going on? It's your boy Ghost here, and today I'm bringing us another Warzone 3 video. And today we'll be taking a look at the M4, which actually received a buff pretty recently. I can't remember which major update it received the buff in. I don't know if it was Season 4 Reloaded or if it was Season 5, but this gun has been buffed pretty recently. And to be honest, it definitely needed some type of buff because this gun, even right now in its current state, after getting buffed, is still a little lackluster, which means that prior to this buff, it was even worse. And to be honest, I don't even recall that because I've used this weapon already in Warzone 3. And at those times, it didn't really feel that bad. But using it this time around, it felt weird. Like, it just definitely felt like it was lacking something. Whether it was the damage, the recoil, like, all those two things, like, really are noticeable. And I try using the iron side on this. It's kind of, it's really difficult. Because the recoil is not helping you. And then the visual shake on your iron sights is terrible. The gun smoke, this just does not feel good at all iron sight and it sucks because i love the m4 iron sight i loved using it in 2019 and warzone 2 and in this game it just felt like they didn't do it this gun justice which again i know it's a part of a different game but they, they messed this up man i felt like it was not like this in mw2 it, it felt like it definitely regressed in some way without them actually nerfing it it just is not the greatest and even in this situation as you guys can see i'm not even using a suppressor because using a suppressor doesn't allow for the greatest like a recoil control so i had to switch it up to try to get more recoil control because it was it was getting there but even with the sight and all this like there's no really any other attachment that's significant for recoil control like you can use a rear grip but then again you're going to be stuck with the iron sight and that gun smoke and all that there's no real good stock and so i had to kind of figure out a way to try to make it a little better and this is what we got but anyways, like I said, this gun's not completely terrible. There were some good moments with this in this gameplay. I still definitely had a little bit of fun using it, but I felt like there could be more to it with this weapon. I don't think they're going to actually buff it between now and the end of the game, but if they do, hey, I'm all for it. But anyways, before we get into this gameplay, I want to say if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button or to 6,000. Just hit 5.06, so thank you guys a lot for that. And as always, if you do enjoy it, hit that like button. Take that I'm out. Peace. Mark. I was like, bro, did I really just get a Sidewinder? And I was about to be pissed because I was like, there's no way that's my only gun. Thankfully, it wasn't. It's a lot of activities, a lot of things happening right now. That, what just, what was that? I saw that explosion in front of me. That guy just died. Or it looked like he died. You gotta wake up, brother. It's it like that. Like, I didn't even stand a chance, bro. Like, even if I got headshots, I don't even think I win that. That was such a lopsided that. Moving it to my mark. No, my friend.
That's not the guy that I killed earlier. I'm so unbelievably fucked right now. We're so bad. I didn't, well, I didn't think he saw me. <laughs> I, mean, I, you. I saw him cross, and I'm like, I gotta make the cross. I didn't think he saw me. Well, we got 22, though, so we'll take that. Definitely a better, better experience than M4. Finally, the M4 did something that I felt like it was capable of doing. Like, my God, I felt like it, in times it was letting me down, but it was, it was turning up, man. That's what I was expecting from the M4, and I finally got that. So, we'll take it.